I felt very isolated. Is there ever anything that's really hard for you uh, girls to open up about? Yeah. 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 <laughs> <laughs> I mean, for me, like my relationship has been really hard just because um, so many people have their opinions about it. And I understand that, I get that, but it's really, really tough to put something you love and you care about out there just for everyone else to tear it down. So like, it's been a really, really tough journey with like social media and just like having everyone, you know, constantly tear something that you, you cherish so much and just to like, it's it's tough it's really tough so i think you know i mean I'm, I'm so grateful that people care and want to you know put their two cents in and have their opinions and like are so invested in our show but at the same time like it's really hard to like put ourselves out there and then to get so much criticism in return is it's tough i mean how do you how do you not let that affect your relationship with us um actually if anything i think it it pushed me closer and i felt for a very long time that i had no one else to turn to you know, because I, at, in the beginning, I didn't have my ho my whole family support. I mean, I, I did have, you know, my mom was always very supportive, um, but I did I felt very isolated. Mm -hmm. And then having the world on top of that, like be against my relationship. I think if anything, it pushed me closer to Ish to the point where it was unhealthy. Mm -hmm. And so oh, I had to navigate that and, you know, feel yeah. more comfortable with just, you know, standing up for what I believe in and you know, standing up for what I want. and. Like Ish and I couldn't even have, like I couldn't come to people and say like, we're having like normal arguments, you know? Cause everyone would just be like, oh, it's the age difference. Like you guys aren't meant yeah. to be together. Whereas anyone else could say like, you know, I'm, me and my boyfriend are arguing and no one would think a second thought about it. Sure. So it's tough, but I do feel like, you know, Ish and I are in a really, really good place right now. Yeah. Like I think yeah. you're really raw and open. I think so people are gonna be able to relate to that in so many ways that like, I'm really proud of you for Thanks. doing that this season. Thanks. Yeah, I mean, you know, we see, I know you haven't seen the first episode, but we do see in the first episode when you watch back Amanda's film about her dad and how that really affected you. I mean, how did, why did that really kind of strike a nerve with you? And does that age gap still bother you? It does. It does. And I think it always will. And I think because I, I had everyone else against me, I had to put up this front, you know, like, I don't care or, you know, it, it doesn't bother me. Like I'm okay with it. I had to like double down, you know, and like overcompensate and say like it, 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 the age difference didn't bother me at all because I felt I didn't have anyone I could open up to, you know? And now I realized, you know, like if I just talk to my friends about how I'm feeling, of course they're gonna support me. I don't need to be so isolated and feel, you know, like I can't, I don't have to keep these things bottled up. Mm -hmm. So seeing Amanda like open up about her her dad like having such a big age difference with her mom like was really this this moment where i kind of just like broke down it was like you know i just like it was so much bottled up and it was just like I, if had i had i just like opened up to my friends of course they would have supported me you know and so for so long i just felt like i couldn't and now i kind of came to like a boiling <laughs> point and and that was it that was that amanda's thing 